Hey guys, and welcome to another Minecraft tree video. Today, I'm going to talk more about 1.7 tree generation and how I would like to see it be changed in my way, of course. This is all my opinion and stuff I would like to see. Hopefully, you guys could back me up on this. So, I will leave the map for download so you guys can check these out and maybe world edit them and remix them if you want. But anyways, let's get started. So, as you can see, we have a normal forest biome trees, so oak trees. So we have the small versions, we have the medium size, which is the one from the previous video, and then we have the larger size. So uh, the things you wanna note is small, medium, large, and then you have the trees branching upwards. Upwards, not necessarily to the side much, even though some are, because you do need to keep that aspect, but most of them are going upwards. So these are more of like a fully grown, healthy tree. So here it is with no leaves, the small tree, and then with leaves. So there you get that look. I like it. You could probably add another tiny one uh, right here. Maybe make the leaves a little bit more upwards, but that's that. This video we talked about in the last one. No leaves, leaves. Really like that look. And um, you, you might see this a bit, which is my fault. Uh, you, you can see how it's flat, mostly because um, I'm working from the front, so I really don't notice the back has no leaves. So, yeah, if you see that, uh, I'm sorry, but it, they're supposed to be leaves. It's very similar, so I and I'll fix it up. Like right here as well, you can just put some leaves in here. I'm surprised I did that. That's weird. Um, but yeah. Anyways, here's the large tree, no leaves. And then with leaves and you can see some are drooping down on the side and now we're gonna move to the taiga biome and uh, if you're going to be in a more frosted area cold a nice frigid area you're gonna no notice a lack of leaves plus the shortage of wood because you know it's it, a lot of these trees might be dead some of them are still up here but these are, you know, more, there's less, there's less wood on them, basically. What I did is I took some of these trees, I placed them, and then I broke off some blocks and I moved some. So it's a remix version of that with this logs plus a little bit trimmed. So, no leaves, and then with leaves. And as you can see, there's only a little bit of leaves, just a tiny bit. Um, not as much as that one, or that one, or that one. And now the medium-sized tree with leaves and without. As you can see it has the snow on it. And I'll do the toggle, the toggle downfall. Downfall. And then we have the large tree with more leaves because it's larger. And then we have the with no ooh, lightning. And then we have um, a large with no leaves. All right, toggle downfall. Okay. And now we have the swamp trees, and these were a little bit tricky because I didn't know what to do with them. They're, I guess you could say they're a little bit similar to those trees over there, uh, the oak trees. But if you guys do notice, and I looked up swamp trees, and I looked through a few, and I saw a lot of trees. And let me take this over here. Um, it'll have, it'll be in the water, and let's say this is a larger tree. It'll go up like this, like there are little feet, and then it'll start to come in and make the, make the, the whole tree. So that's what I tried to recreate for a smaller size tree. And here it is. So you got this over here. No leaves, and then with leaves and vines, of course. So there you go. And also we have beach. So a beach themed coconut tree. I didn't know really what to put, so I put cocoa beans. Uh, I like this a lot. And there you go. Uh, not much spent on the beach. Kind of just threw down some sand and world edited a bunch of water. And the jungle tree, I'm sorry, I just couldn't do it. I'm still working on this thing. It's very confusing. I looked up I looked up jungle trees and I found, you know, they're, they're the huge style because lots of vegetation, lots of water uh, it put into these things. So they're really grown. They're really, really grown. There will be vines on this. But I, I didn't notice that there was a straight log, the straight uh, the straight logs all the way up, and then there were things wrapping around it. So I said, well, what if I 
create another thing wrapping around it. And I sort of just went two, up, two, up, two, up. And that's what I did. Of course, it's not done yet, so when it's done, I'll make an updated video. But for now, you got your beautiful coconut trees, your swamp trees. Uh, you can make a large version of this. Just take take the oak tree, remix the bottom a little bit, and you're, you're good. So here you go. Also, you want to you know look at these notice signs when I put them down and I'll also leave a sign on how to world edit these in your maps notice the trunk branching off towards the bottom of the water and this one I don't know exactly what I put uh, palm trees so yeah anyways hope you guys enjoyed if you did leave it a like subscribe if you haven't already and comment down below if you want to see more 1.7 features that I might be able to create for you guys and uh, if you guys want to do me a huge favor and I get this video out there maybe I can spread this idea through Mojang and get them to do more tree generations and I know they probably are I saw them in some of the pictures so not not saying they should use mine not saying I'm the best at everything um, but you know I like these trees and I would like to see more remix trees like the swamp some uh, palm trees some new taiga trees now I know this might be a little bit hard for the code but I'm sure they can pull it off um, but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.